some breaking news this morning. 19-year-old was killed in a shooting in Tampa. Tampa police now investigating this violence in the Jackson Heights neighborhood. Beth Rousseau is live at the scene. And Beth, this is the latest victim in a recent string of gun violence that has been happening across Tampa. It's just so sad. Off of these streets, but take a look just past me, past the crime scene tape. You can see a firearm laying right there in the middle of the road next to evidence marker four. Right now we're at 37th and Wilder. That's where police say that they found this 19 year old shot and he later died of his injuries at the hospital. This comes less than 24 hours after police chief Mary O'Connor addressed these recent shootings among teens. She provided an update on the shooting that injured a 17 year old just feet away from Robinson High School and then just Tuesday of course when a 16 year old was shot and killed outside the McDonald's on North Armenia Avenue. Now since her swearing in the chief has been hosting forums in neighborhoods that are hot spots for shooting. Just yesterday she says the gun violence has to stop especially among teenagers. We need the community to know that children and a gun are a very bad mix. So we need parents to know that if they have a firearm in their home to make sure it doesn't get into the hands of their children, make sure it's secured. And back out here live at 37th and Wilder, police say there is a shot spotter in this area. That is what notified them to this shooting that killed this 19 year old. They arrived just two minutes after those shots were fired and they were sounded by shot spotter. We're going to be out here throughout the morning just trying to learn more details from police about who the victim is, whether or not they have anyone in custody or whether they're searching for anyone. As soon as we have any of those details, we'll bring them to you here on air and on the WFLA app. We're live this morning. Beth Russo, eight on your side.